Hey guys, thanks for coming to yoga. I'm Callie. Just gonna be doing some nice, simple, easy wake up good morning yoga today. We're gonna get started by coming down onto our backs, bringing those feet out right in front of you, making that spine nice and long and straight. Just taking a couple of moments to settle down onto your mat. And then we'll start by bringing one hand to your heart, one hand on top of your body, closing your eyes, sealing your lips down, taking a nice deep breath, feeling your chest expand, feeling that belly rise underneath the knee. As you exhale, pushing that air out of your body, pushing all the hair out of your lungs. Taking a couple of nice deep breaths just like that on your own. One more big breath. And then bringing those hands down to your side, bringing the soles of the feet down, letting those knees point straight up toward the ceiling. And just taking a minute to rock those knees from one side to the other, which you like to bring your legs out. And then walking those feet together, bringing those knees together, reaching those arms out wide beside you. Taking a nice deep breath. And as you exhale, letting those knees fall over to the left side. See if you can keep both of your shoulder blades down on the mat. Maybe looking over your right fingertips, taking a nice gentle twist. And then inhaling those knees up. And as you exhale, letting those knees come over to the right. Keeping both of your shoulders down, looking out over your left fingers. And then inhale, coming back to the center. Bringing those hands to the back of your thighs, lifting those knees up. And then just starting to rock front to back. Giving yourself a little spinal massage. Letting those legs come up and over. Just rolling back and forth a few times. As you're ready, we'll try to sit up, finding that spot on your bottom that you can balance, keeping those legs up, reaching those arms up, coming into your boat pose. Imagining your body like a little boat floating on the ocean, keeping your spine nice and straight and strong, keeping those knees lifted, reaching for those hands. As you inhale, reaching your arms up, stretching those legs out long. Exhale, bringing those arms to the left side. Inhale, reaching. Exhale, to the right. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, to the right. Inhale, up. Exhale, to the right. And bringing those feet down. Moving those knees from one side to the other. Lifting those legs out. And then we'll come to sit up nice and tall, stretching those legs out in front, leaving that right leg nice and straight. We're going to bring that left foot to the inside of that right thigh. Keeping a little soft bend in your right knee, sitting up nice and tall. Inhale those arms up. And 
as you exhale, starting to reach toward that foot, maybe bringing that grip over the ball of your foot, maybe bringing that grip to your ankle here. See if you can bring that forehead down on top of your knee, keeping that knee bent as much as you need to. And if you're ready, starting to slide that heel forward, nice and gentle. Releasing that grip, reaching those arms up, switching those legs out, tucking that right foot in, keeping that left knee nice and soft, and reaching those arms up. On your exhale, finding your grip, maybe on that foot, maybe on your ankle. Maybe see if you can bring that forehead down to the knee. And as you're ready, gently sliding that left heel forward, melting it down, breathing it down into it. And inhale, sitting up tall, bringing both feet out in front of you, keeping those knees nice and soft. And then using those peace fingers, your first two fingers, see if you can loop those around your big toes. Trying to make that spine nice and long and straight, maybe walking those six bones out underneath you. And as you're ready, starting to exhale forward, maybe sliding those heels forward. See if you can lay that body right on the top of your legs. And then releasing that grip, sitting up tall, crossing those legs over. Start to roll forward and onto your hands and knees. Coming into your tabletop position. Finding that nice straight spine here, bringing those knees right below your hips, spreading those fingers wide, and then smoothing through a little cat cow with inhale, dropping that belly, lifting that chest, arching the back. Exhale as you pull that belly in, rounding your spine, tucking your chin into your cat. Breathing through that. Chest. Exhale, pulling that belly in, rounding it forward. Coming back to that tabletop, we'll turn those hands around so that those fingertips are pointing back toward your knees. Just moving through a little cat cow here. Inhale, dropping your belly, lifting your chest. Exhale, pulling it in, rounding. Maybe do that once more. And then turning those fingertips back toward the front of the mat. You start to ground into your right hand. And on your inhale, lifting that left arm up, reaching those fingers toward the ceiling. So if you can open your chest up. Maybe bringing that hand behind your back, keeping a little bind here. And then inhale, reaching your arm. And on your exhale, sending that left arm under your right arm, threading the needle, dropping that left shoulder down, dropping your left ear, walking those right fingertips up above your head. And just taking a couple of breaths here as you melt down into the spine. Starting to walk those right fingertips back in beneath your shoulder, pushing into that hand. Reach that left arm up. Exhale, lowering it down. Moving through cat cow. Inhale, dropping your belly. Lift 
Tucking your chest to the crown. Exhale, pulling it in, tucking your chin, pulling that belly button up to your spine. And coming back to tabletop, this time grounding your left hand into the mat. We'll inhale that right arm up. Reach in through your fingers, maybe bringing that hand behind you. Inhale, reaching it up, exhale, threading it through. Dropping your right shoulder down this time. Walking that left hand up above. Please take in some breaths. And you melt down into it. And then we'll start to walk that hand back in, pushing into that left hand, reaching that right arm up, lowering down. And make the one more cat cow in and out, walking your belly, lifting your chest. Exhale, pulling it in, tucking your chin. And then tucking those toes underneath you, and starting to walk those hands back. And pushing up into a nice low squat. Keeping the heels lifted high, keeping the knees bent, maybe moving those knees from one side to the other. Just letting that head hang nice and long right between those knees. Taking the breath. And then we'll start to make our way. To a standing position, rounding those heels down, bending through one knee and then the other, and then the whole spine hang nice and long. Grabbing those opposite elbows, walking from one side to the other. Meeting back in the middle, we'll inhale, rolling it up nice and slow, coming up one vertebrae at a time. Then rolling those shoulders back, letting that chin come out last. Making our way up to the top of our mats for sun salutation B. We start with those toes together, rounding into both feet, coming into your mountain pose. Really reaching up through the crown of your head, finding that spot to focus the gaze on in front of you. And on your inhale, we'll scoop those arms up, bringing those hands into prayer, reaching through your fingertips. And on your exhale, starting to bend into those knees, coming into your chair pose or fierce pose. Really want to ground into those feet. Starting to bring that weight back into your heels, reaching through those arms. And as you exhale, see if you can bend those knees just a little bit deeper, setting those hips back just a little bit further. And release, inhale, up. Exhale, hands down, heart center. Holding forward, bringing those hands to the mat. Inhale, can you come way up? Exhale, stepping it back, coming into your plank or knee plank position here. Finding that nice long spine. And on your exhale, pulling those elbows in close, keeping that body nice and straight and strong, lowering down, and then pushing the tops of your feet into the mat, coming into your cobra pose, lifting that gaze, using that nice strong spine, lifting chest. And then tucking those toes, pulling back into your down dog position. Just taking a minute here, bending through one leg and then the other. And then we'll bring those toes together, really pushing into your hands. And on your inhale, bringing that right leg up behind you, keeping that hip level. On your exhale, pulling that knee 
into your chest, stepping that foot through between your hands, maybe using that right hand to help guide that foot through. Grounding those feet, finding your balance. And on your inhale, starting to rise up, maybe bringing those hands to your hips, squaring your body forward. Inhale, reaching those arms up. Nice and tall, coming into your crescent pose. Exhale, folding forward. Sitting that right foot back up behind you. Lowering it down. And then looking up to the top of the mat and start to step or hop those feet up. Rounding those feet into the mat. And then you'll rolling it up nice and slow. Get into that mountain pose. And then we'll inhale those arms up your sides, reaching through those fingers. Exhale, coming into your chair pose. Keeping that belly folded, keeping that weight in your heels, reaching through your fingers, melting your hips down. Just trusting yourself here. Nice and strong. One last breath. And release in, reaching the up. Exhale, hands down here at center, folding forward. Bring those hands in front of you. On your inhale, hands to shift, flattening that spine, reaching that crown of the head forward. Exhale, hands to the mat, stepping those feet back, coming to plank your knee plank. On your exhale, lowering it down, moving through Chaturanga, coming through Cobra or Pasta, and moving back to your down dog. Taking a breath here, and bringing those toes together. On your inhale, that left leg comes up behind, keeping those hips level. On your exhale, pulling that knee. Stepping your foot through, maybe using that left hand to help bring it through. Keeping your back heel lifted. And slowly making your way up to your crescent pose. Maybe bringing those hands to your hips. Finding that place of balance. And then we'll inhale, reaching those arms up. Exhale, hands on either side of that left foot. Holding that knee and sending that foot up behind you. Lower it again. And then looking up to the top of the mat. Start to step those feet up. Grounding your feet into the mat. Rolling it up nice and slow. Bringing that chin out last. Coming into your mountain pose. Inhale, reaching those arms up. Exhale, chair pose. Pulling that belly in. Reaching those pinky fingers toward one another. Bringing that weight back. Sinking back just a little bit more. Inhale, the up. Hands in prayer. Exhale, holding forward. Hands to the mat. Inhale, coming halfway up. Exhale, step it back. Coming down through plank or knee plank. Moving through your cobra. Moving back in your down dog. Taking a breath, pedaling your legs out. Bringing your toes together. And on your inhale, bringing that right leg up behind you. Exhale, step it back. Keeping your back heel lifted, inhale, reaching those arms up. Nice and tall, nice and strong. This time on your exhale, bringing those hands behind you, interlacing your fingers, pulling those shoulders together. Keep looking up at the ceiling. One more breath. And release. Inhale, reaching your arms up, exhale, hands up. Holding that hand, sending it up behind, lowering it down. And then we'll bend, you know, flowing forward to plank or knee plank. Lowering down, nice and 
terms of maybe coming back to that dogma, just taking it back. Bringing your toes together, pull in, hold out one leg up behind you. On your exhale, stepping that foot through. Keeping your back heel lifted, slowly making your way up to that crescent pose, finding balance here. Inhale, reaching those arms up. Exhale, interlacing those fingers, pulling your shoulder blades together. Pulling those hands away from your bottom, really lifting that gaze up, seeing that feeling. And release. Reaching those arms, exhale, lowering it. Pulling your hands and up behind you. Lowering it down. Looking up to the top of the mat. Start to step those feet up. Nice and slow. Grounding your feet here. Pedaling those legs back and forth. On your inhale, slowly rolling it up. Nice and slow. Bringing that chin out last. Coming to stand in your mountain pose. Seeing if you can make that spine just a little bit longer this time. We're going to start to bring that weight over into your left foot, starting to open that right knee out to the side, coming into your tree pose. So maybe just bringing that foot to the inside of your calf here, maybe kickstanding those toes if you're having a little off-balance day, or maybe bringing that foot up nice and high to the inside of your thigh, wherever at you're in your tree. Maybe bringing those hands back together, lifting up tall through the crown of your head, finding that place to focus your gaze on, and just quieting your mind down as you find the place of stillness. You might even reach those arms up and feel nice and straight and strong, growing your tree branches tall, reaching through the tips of your fingers, and release. Bringing that right foot down, coming back to that mountain pose, maybe walking those legs out for just a moment. And as you're ready, we'll bring that weight over into your right leg. Turning that left knee out and finding your tree on this side, whatever works best for you. Maybe bringing those hands back together, finding that place to focus your gaze, keeping that foot sealed down to the mat. If your foot's a big suction cup, keeping you anchored there. And if you're ready, you're starting to Grow those arms nice and tall, reaching through those fingers. Maybe swaying gently in the breeze. And then releasing that left leg down, standing in that mountain pose for just a moment. Start to lower our bodies down. Sit down on the mat. Keeping those knees back, keeping the soles of the feet onto the mat. And then we'll inhale, bringing that right leg up and over the top of the left leg. Maybe reaching through, threading the needle, grabbing the back of that left thigh. So Nice and tall. Maybe just rocking back and forth for just a moment here. And then, you know, releasing that leg. Rocking those knees 
Sitting up tall, reaching those arms out in front of you, and as you exhale, gently rolling it back nice and slow. Bringing those arms up, taking a nice long whole body stretch. Bringing those hands in the prayer, crossing your thumbs, pointing your toes. And then starting to walk those hands over to the right. Walking those toes to the right, like you're a big banana lying on your side. Feeling a nice deep stretch through the left side of your body. Banana crossing. Starting to walk it over to the other side. Trying to keep the shoulders and hips down on the mat. Stretching through your fingers, stretching through your toes. Trying to stretch just a little bit deeper. And release. Coming back to the center. One more nice long stretch. Engaging all of your muscles. Really flexing your legs. Really pulling your belly in. Making those arms strong and lengthen just a little bit more. And release. Exhaling all of that air out. Bringing those arms down by your sides. Taking a moment to line up your spine. Maybe rolling your head from one side to the other. Maybe wiggling your jaw out. See where you can release any tension. And as you're ready, settling down and feeling your whole body supported. Just feeling all of the tension melt out of you, melting out of your body, melting down through the core. Softening your breath. And taking the next few minutes to totally relax.
Let's start to make our way back to our breath. Turn deep with those inhales. Maybe starting to wiggle those fingers and toes. Rolling those ankles around. Reversing the direction. As we breathe in, reaching those arms up, stretching out long. And as we let it go, pulling the knees in, wrapping those arms up the top of your chins. Just rolling from side to side for a moment. As you're ready, rolling over to one side. Hugging those knees in close, cradling your head in the crook of your arm. Taking a couple of breaths here. And as we're ready, start to come up to that comfortable seated position. Maybe crossing those legs over, maybe sitting up on top of those knees, bringing those feet out behind. Just finding that position where you can sit up nice and tall, bringing those hands on top of your thighs. We're going to have one final breath of fire here. Using our belly as a pump, we'll push the air out, going shh, shh, making a sound of choo choo train. So we'll inhale, feeling it up. Nice and full. And begin. Yeah. Okay.